our co-main event, please give me Bruno. Our final kickboxing bout of the evening in our co-main event, Bruno G weighing in yesterday officially at 173.6 pounds. He is undefeated at 1-0, representing KO Zone. Both guys about six foot tall, uh, looking pretty serious at weigh-ins yesterday. Respectfully serious, as it were. And uh, Bruno Jean, again, coming in a little bit light, but um, that's okay. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, looking lean and mean today. This will be a kickboxing bout for our main, or excuse me, our co-main event. And then you know what's coming up next. Kyle Money Hamill looks to enter that champ champ conversation. Taking on Horace D. Wood. Now Bruno Jean has combat experience outside of kickboxing, but tonight will be kickboxing only. Please give me Jonathan. And here comes Jonathan Samarini representing ATT Sunrise and the U, former kicker for University of Miami, and he's doing kickboxing. What? Keep an eye on the feet. Moving out of this guy, last time we saw him was in mixed martial arts competition right here from Coral Springs, Florida at XFN and World Class Combat Sports 47, where he put on a Johnny Brook in his debut. Also one and one as a kickboxer. Again, there we see the Wolfpack corner. Landon Quinone is looking angry about something. By the way, for those of you who are listening and concerned, um, Robert Carter earlier had dislocated his foot off that uh, off his leg kick that was checked uh, by Cesar Pantoja. It has been reset at the local Broward County Medical Facility. So Robert Carter doing A-OK. -okay. World Class Combat Sports brings you the co-main event of the evening. Our bout is a 175 pound kickboxing batch sanctioned by UMAF and sponsored by the law offices of Matthew Glassman at hatejail.com. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get down to business. Introducing first, out of the blue corner, standing at six foot tall, weighing in at 173.6 pounds, with an unblemished record of one win, zero losses, a 29-year-old fighter out of KO Zone. Bruno, looking like Andrew Tate. Ja! And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, standing six foot tall, weighing in at 176 pounds, with a record of one win. One loss, a 29-year-old fighter out of MMA Science Academy. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Jonathan Samarini. Our official for this bout is Tracy Moorhead. Co-main event of the evening, a very pro Samarini crowd. Again, a few miles down the turnpike, he was a kicker for the University of Miami. Round number one, your co-main event underway. XFN WCCS 48. Nice double jab there from Samarini. Beautiful foot sweep as well. Holy doctor. Silva back up. Silva, excuse me, Gene back up. On the pressure is Bruno Jean. Good body kick. 
Both guys changing the body, getting hot and heavy, frantic action. Calling up by myself, happy to be here. Low kick checked and answered the overhand right. Low uh, body kick from Semarini. I will do my best to keep up with this pace. Double jab, left hook. By, oh, nice attack there from Gene. High kick from Semarini. Body kick, a body shot from Semarini to counter the body kick. They are hot and heavy. Holy doctor. Nice attack there against the cage by Gene. Good uppercut by Gene as well. Same or anything about takedown. This is not MMA, but kickboxing, and he goes to pull half guard. Uh-oh. Never a good sign when you pull deep half in a kickboxing bout. Simarini throws a jab. Gene, oh, good leg kick from Simarini, but body shot by Gene. Gene pressure into the cage. Overhand right by Simarini off the reversal. They landed. Another good catch and sweep by Simarini. No room to breathe. Holy cow, they are getting after it. Double jab again, thinking for Semarini. Body kick, body kick, catch and sweep by Semarini. Busy, busy. Leg kick, overhand right by Semarini. Body shot by Semarini. Into a clinch. Traded knees, struggle to the back. 10 seconds left. Semarini striking out of the clinch. Listen to this crowd. One round in the books. Holy cow, what is the strike count? Watch this action run back. Good leg kicks from Silva. And a beautiful, beautiful foot sweep by Semarini. High kick blocked. Nice frame for distance from Silva, uh, from Dean. Really shut down. This is not, this is not Bruno Silva, I apologize. Nice, nice body shot counter to that, uh, that leg kick. Dangerous uh, proposition. Good right hand, then palm with a dab again by Sim on the way out. Another beautiful catch and sweep by Sim He's got that down back, good leg kick by Gene. Good body kick by Gene, but it gets caught and swept. I lost count of the caught kick foot sweeps from Semarini that round. Seconds out, locking them up. Round number two is underway. Bruno, Gene, and Jonathan Semarini. Oh, nice right hand from Semarini. Doubles up on it, see what's happening. Another good right hand. Pro Semarini crowd, I'm gonna lay out for a minute. Semarini putting a lot of faith in that right hand to the body. He is landing it a lot. Uh-oh. Leg kick from Semarini, slips and falls. Shin guard comes down his leg. The canvas tonight has been slippery for some. Uppercut by Gene, left, right hook by Semarini, leg kick by Semarini. Gene on the pressure, inside leg kick, right hand. Gene doing a good job of framing. He needs to maintain his distance and keep Semarini outside. Another good catch and sweep from Semarini. Nice, nice low, low kick there out of the Roger Crawl fighter. No surprise there. Gene forcing the clinch there against the cage. Simran reverses. Great. This is not Muay Thai. They're not going to be allowed to hang out in that clinch for too long. Nice. Another good overhand right counter from Simarini. That's his best punch. That's what scored him a big knockdown in his MMA debut. Simarini going back to the body shots. And Gene is a very crisp, long striker. Again, love to see him work more distant. Semarini doing a good job of crashing. Good jab over the top. Good roll there. Needed the body by Gene. You barely call it. Two in the books, one to go. Crowd is hot. Action is hot and heavy. Ladies and gentlemen, are you not entertained?
co-main event of the evening has been non-stop action. John Semarini and Bruno Jean. A mixed styles card, our final kickboxing bout co-main event. It is earning its position. Uppercut didn't land, overhand didn't land. Montanier misses, that leg kick did not miss at all. Me in the clinch there for Semarini, answered back, but caught and swept by Semarini. Good leg kick from Semarini. Bruno Jean had some nice crisp combinations that round as well. Good, good right hand, though. Not really able to back Semarini up like he wanted to. Good knee to the body from uh, Jean right there. Last minute words, last two minutes of our co-main event of the evening. Johnny Semarini and Bruno Jean. Round number three is get started. Touch the gloves, right to work. Semarini likes that right hand to the body. Good calf kick, low, low. Another good low, low. Roger Paul, the first guy I saw really bringing that out in people. No surprise he brought it out of Semarini. Semarini likes that right hand too, though. There's the break. Bruno Jean hanging on. Nice right hand from Jean, knee to the body as well. But Semarini just will not be faced through him right on top of me. Severini got about 18 sweeps this fight. They don't score like they do in Muay Thai, but that's okay. Both guys trade leg kicks. Sweat fly from Severini as Gene lands a shot. Man, those low kicks. Body shot, catches Gene off balance, sends it to the canvas. I would have scored that a knockdown. Tracy Moorhead does not do that. Right hand upstairs from Severini. Other right hand not landed. Bruno Jean's defense has blocked a lot more than it's allowed to get through. But Semarini's landed some good shots. When he get put, he get a nice counter leg kick there from Jean. Nice right hand from Jean, a good right hand, actually. Whenever Jean's been able to put combinations together, he's looked very good on offense. 30 seconds left. Tracy Moorhead trying to restore some order here. Keep these guys by, wow, man. Leg kick from Jean. Overhand right, or straight right from Sam Rainey, more body shots from Sam Rainey. Side clinch separates them. Short time now, 20 seconds. Gene doesn't really have any stank on his shots here, but still put together good combinations. Sam Rainey just has a little bit more natural power. Oh, hard low, low kick, shin to shin. Who's the bigger man now? 10 seconds left. Jab on the break for Sam Rainey. Gene with a couple good shots to answer. Right hand doesn't land for Sam Rainey, but a leg kick for Gene does, and that is that. Wow, wow, high octane action right here from Coral Springs. Non-stop action, you can watch the playback, I didn't want to call it. Constant pressure from Sam Marini. A lot of big shots landed, some good volume combinations. Gene, Gene was there the whole time, but every time Gene got comfortable throwing a kick above the leg, Sam Marini kind of Caught it, did a, a swept the foot. There we see it go through both legs, the leg shot, and there was that right hand of the body. San Marini, a lot of right hands of the body. A lot of right hands of the body in that fight. Wow. There was a nice combination that didn't quite land like you wanted it to. Good, uh, good lean back and leg kick there from Gene. Again, both guys putting on an amazing bout. And at the end of three rounds, we go to the judges' table. Our first judge scores this bout, 30-28, in favor of the blue corner. Our second judge scores this bout, 30-26, in favor of the red corner. And our final judge scores the bout, 30-27, for your winner by split decision, out of the red corner, Jonathan Simarini.
You I am here with your winner. We do got a schedule to keep. Johnny! 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 Well deserved. You came out here and put on a great performance. High throttle the whole time. Never took your foot off the gas. A lot of good right hands to the body looking to kind of slow down the, uh, the high output. That, uh, that's, that uh, Bruno Jean was also bringing on. A lot of good low kicks, lot, uh, like 15 or 5,500 uh, uh, foot sweeps where you kept catch, catching the foot, I, I, I lost count. But you put on a great performance. Judge's scorecard's a little wonky. One, uh, neither judge, no, no judges gave the other guy any rounds. That's kind of weird, probably, probably tie those up again. But um, Mr. San Marini, you put on a heck of a show. Thank you, thank you. Uh, first, I just want to give a thank you to Landon, Roger, my coach, Roger Craw. He's the best coach for MMA in all of the world. Um, another another special shout out I want to give. It is my my mom and dad's anniversary, and uh, a week ago from today was uh, my dad's third heavenly birthday. So happy anniversary! That's my mom right there, and uh, I'm just thankful to be Daddy. here and uh, to be here surrounded by the people I love and be surrounded by good people and good energy and. Uh, I'm grateful for all of it, and that's all I want to say. Let's go, All righty, well, then I'll go ahead and wrap it up with a bow. I'll say that's the second time that you fought for world-class combat sports here in Coral Springs. I hope that you're here every show as long as you want to be. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jonathan Samarini.